what up guys, Wally here, bringing you a team deathmatch on WMD. Uh, I'm going to scare you guys here real quick. Uh, you think I'm going to use the AK-74U, but no worries. Uh, right before the game starts, I come to my senses and decide to change uh, back to a reasonable gun. And uh, to be honest, I don't think I've actually ever gotten a gameplay with the AK-74U, which is kind of sad because it is a really good gun. But uh, part of the reason is I honestly never really use it as a class. This was very early uh, in the game. This is a while back. And um, before it was kind of the god gun that no one should use. But um, I don't know, once a gun does become like considered the god gun or, or the really strong gun in the game, um, I kind of tend to stay away from it and try not to use it that much. And honestly, in my belief, I don't think it's that much overpowered than the assault rifles. But uh, for whatever reason, I don't know, I just tend to stay away from it. But I do have like a weird rule when it comes to these type of guns. Like when I do see the AK-74U on the ground, I will pick it up and use it. And I don't know why, in my mind, that's okay, but uh, having a class is not. It really doesn't make any sense. I thought I'd just explain it to you, because you will see me pick it up and use it a little bit in this game. And I don't want you to think I'm a huge hypocrite, even though I kind of am. So you can think I'm a huge hypocrite if you want, because I do pick it up right there. And I do, I think, use it a little bit in this game. But whatever. Uh, that's enough talking on that. Anyways, um, I decided I'd use a a team deathmatch because I've been playing a lot of domination lately and I don't want you guys to always just get the same thing over and over again I thought I'd mix it up a little bit and um share something a little new with you guys and then also uh you know if you're one of my new subscribers who's come to my channel then obviously this is all new to you because you haven't seen me before and uh, I just want to issue a quick welcome to you guys I hope you guys enjoy your time here and I hope that we can uh form a nice relationship and I hope I can be really creepy in this commentary and scare you off no I'm just kidding but uh yeah I do hope you guys enjoyed here um you know please leave comments feel free to you know tell me what you guys think because obviously getting your feedback is the way that I can you know make my comments I mean make my commentaries better uh suited to you guys and your liking and, and try to pick topics that I think everybody finds interesting so feel free to do that you know give me your feedback and stuff and I guess uh on this note I will uh issue another thank you to uh, Snipinator. Uh, thank you so much, Snipinator, for letting me come on your channel and uh, post a commentary. It's really awesome to get the, to say that you got the chance to talk to so many people, um, you know, regardless of what avenue it, it, it is, you know, whether it's the internet or real life. I mean, I, I still feel like it's pretty amazing that I can say that, you know, a couple thousand people or however many people are going to end up viewing that video are going to have a chance to listen to me speak. Uh, maybe they haven't. Maybe they're not really listening, but I don't know. I still think it's pretty cool. Um, to be honest, I was really nervous about putting my gameplay up there uh, on your channel. And the reason being is just that I really don't consider myself to be too much of a sniper. Um, I think you guys can tell that uh, from my commentary and just watching the gameplay. I'm really not the strongest sniper uh, in the world. So I was really nervous about how it was going to be taken and, and if people were going to think it was um, you know, worthwhile or not. But I, I was pleasantly surprised. A lot of your subscribers uh, seemed to enjoy my content and gave me a lot of great feedback. Of course, there were people who... Um, you know, didn't enjoy it, and I knew that was going to be the case because I'm not really that much of a sniper, and I felt kind of wrong about going on a sniper the week. But uh, you know, what can you do? And I don't, I don't hold any ill will or anything like that to the people who didn't enjoy the content. I perfectly understand it. If you go in there expecting to see, uh, you know, an up and coming sniper, and you get me, uh, you know, I apologize. But uh, what can you do? You know, I just try to make the best content I can, and and you know, maybe I'll try to make some better sniper gameplays down the road, but. You know, I really can't do too much about it other than that. Anyways, um, I guess what I'm going to do with the rest of the time that I have here, because this is going to be a pretty short um, commentary, I guess I'll talk a little bit about what I plan to do in the future and stuff like that, especially for you you new guys, so you know um, what to expect from me and stuff. Uh, if you've scrolled through some of my videos, I'm sure you've seen that I'm not just a Call of Duty guy. And, uh, you know, the reason being is... is you, there's so many good games out there. There's so much content. There's so many amazing things as a video game player or connoisseur or whatever you want to call yourself. I would never call myself a connoisseur. I think that's really creepy, but I thought it would just be a funny way to describe it. Uh, anyways, um, you know, there's so many good games out there, and there's so much to play and so much to look at that, you know, I can't just focus purely on Call of Duty. There's just too much, and I've done that for too long. I think right as Modern Warfare 2 came in, I was just, you know, purely in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, player that's all I played I ignored all other games uh, focused just on that and it's really easy to just become absorbed in that and just push everything else but there's so many more games and honestly when I play this game and I take a step back from it a little bit I tend to enjoy it a lot more so you guys will see some variety in the gameplay but I want you to know and to understand for all you new guys 
I will put up at least two Call of Duty videos every week. That is a guarantee. I probably will try to step it up to three, um, maybe even four. But I, you know what? I'm going to guarantee three. Screw that. I'm going to get you guys at least in some shape, form, you know, whether it be Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops or something. I will get you three Call of Duty videos a week. And then I'm going to put other stuff out there as well. So there's going to be a lot of content. Uh, some of it might not be stuff that you want to watch. And that's fine, guys. I don't expect you guys to watch all my videos. But I just want you to know why and where I'm coming from so that if you think, like, wow, this guy puts out, like, so much stuff, you know... I don't know, I just like a variety of games, so I guess that's what you guys are going to see. I hope you guys enjoy this channel, and uh, I'm sorry for going past this video. But uh, good chance to get to talk to you guys. I uh, hope to see more in the future. Peace!